recently, uh, since we are all facing uh, environmental constraints, the, 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 we have been asked to uh, consider developing uh, uh, families of environmentally friendly molecules. Uh, phosphorus is one of the notorious elements which can interact with exhaust catalysts, deactivate the active uh, sites, and affect catalyst life and catalyst efficiency. So the Lubrizol, in response to the environmental requirements, have developed brand new environmentally friendly ZDP. We have done quite a number of uh, bench testing and engine testing internally and uh, at the end of our developmental stage we decided so we have to run real life studies. As a part of those studies in cooperation, in cooperation with Ford Research, we ran two year long field test in New York City. We use uh, Ford Crown Victoria 2003 model year taxis and we compare side by side two oils with, which differ only with ZDP technology. One set of taxis had the conventional ZDP, one set of taxis had the oil which contain hyper ZDP. We disassemble engines and look at the parts to assess deposits where and also look very carefully at the oxidation, nitration, the TDN acid number and uh, the pentane insoluble as well as phosphorus retention via used oil analysis. Uh, I am happy to report so our novel ZDP technology protects engine to the same level as the conventional oils. We have not seen any uh, the, the detrimental effects uh, as far as engine wear, upper piston deposits, uh, sludge, and uh, thickening, oil thickening or TBN retention. At the same time, we look at the phosphorus retention in drains by comparing the level of phosphorus in the used oil vis-a-vis -vis level of calcium. Calcium is used as a baseline for such calculations. At the end of our studies, we, we, we found so uh, the new hyper-ZDP offers tremendous advantage as far as phosphorus retention, up to 50% lower amount of phosphorus being present in uh, engine exhaust vis-a-vis -vis conventional uh, ZDP. That 50% reduction means large amount of phosphorus not really leaving the crankcase, not going through exhaust, not depositing on freeway catalyst, which means quite a change in terms of extension of catalyst life and the exhaust emission measurements. All our data, which was done, as I said, in cooperation with Ford Recent, was published in technical literature and presented at two different forums as a part of the Society of Automotive Engineers uh, the technical papers.